Welcome back. There are more than 330,000 veterans in the state of Oklahoma. And as Challenge Maureen Words found out, the VA in Muskogee has found a way to honor each fallen veteran's service and sacrifice. and salutes line the walls of the Muskogee VA as Gene Miller Jr. walks his dad down the halls and through the hospital one last time. Those are the last words he said to all, all of us. It was, I love you. Love for his family and his country. This is Gene Miller Sr. And a quick glimpse at his life show a man with an easy smile. Gene Sr. served in the Air Force for 10 years and was stationed in Korea during the Korean War. He even made it on the cover of a book. Here he is standing in front of Gwenny, the F-86 Sabre he was crew chief on. There's something about being a member of whether Air Force, Army, National Guard, whatever. It's a band of brothers and sisters that you guys when those people, when we got together, we knew we were ready to not just lay down our lives for our country, but to we'd run in front of a bullet for another friend, for another guy. But now, Miller and his family walk. And everyone in the hospital who can, patients, nurses, and family, stand at attention as they walk the body of his father out the door. Part of a new program here called the Honor Walk. You're doing it, and... You don't ever want the honor to end, but you know it has to. Draped in the flag of the country he served and surrounded by the family he loved, Gene Miller Sr. called on once again. But this time, it was for him to come home. Maureen Wirtz, Tulsa's Channel 8. Maureen, thanks. The Honor Walk is a new program. Officials with the VA say they found out about it from another VA in Arkansas and thought it was a perfect way to honor our veterans while showing respect and compassion.